Hello, my name is Maria Jesus, and I am Project Scientist and Mass Program at Cedar Sinai, and I am here to present my post. In this study, we focus in the reduction of methane gas. But why? Because methane gas slows intestinal transit and also associated with constipation. Methanogens produce methane, and one of the most known methanogens in the gastrointestinal tract is Methanobacter smithii. To achieve this, we develop a new molecule that we call CS6. And this molecule blocks MTD, that is an important enzyme in the production of methane. We perform in vitro studies by adding CS6 in different concentrations to stool from humans and rats. And also we did an in vivo study where we were gabashing 5 mg and 10 mg of this compound to rats. We added in vitro C6 to a stool of two different subjects that were constipated and with elevated methane levels in bread and stool. And we saw a reduction after four hours of incubation anaerobically of 42% in the first subject and 71% in the second subject. And we also observed a reduction of methane when we tested the drug in rats. In the in vivo experiment, we develop a phenotype of constipation in rats, and for that we fed the animals with a high fat diet for a month, and we saw that they have less water content. Then we were prepared to gabas with the drug with C6, and we observed that those animals gabas with 10 milligrams for 10 days have higher water content in the stool and less methane in the stool, and surprisingly, these rats have lower increase of weight compar compared to animals gabas with PBS. Based on these results, CX6 may be an important drug for the treatment of methane-associated constipation. Thank you for visiting our poster at DDW 2025.